All right there, everybody. This is going to be, I'm not sure it's going to be a quick video, but I'm going to show you, uh, for those of you who use favourites on Kodi, um, and then update and lose those and have to keep redoing it all the time, I think I've found a way of how to uh, to fix this and to save them. I've not tried it yet, so this is a first run, and if it works, great, and if not, well, I'll just pretend it's the first one. <laughs> uh, you'll never know the difference. So what you're going to need is ES File Explorer, uh, which is that app just there, which is highlighted. If you don't have that already, uh, just download it from the App Store. It's free. You don't have to pay for it. Uh, once you're in there, in fact, first of all, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you hate this new setup, uh, my Cody, um, and I'll run through it, we'll save the favourites and we'll update and make sure that it's actually, uh, it does work. So as you can see I'm on 6.2.1 there, um, there is a new one which is 6.2.2, .2, so hopefully this should, should all work. Um, if we just go in and add a couple of my favourites just for mine because it's easier, um, it'd be the same premise for Exodus and all of those at the same time. So if we just go into my movies... And we'll just favourite five or six of them. Go back to the main menu. I'll show you that they are they are actually saved in the favourites. So you can see there. They're the ones that I've favourited, so obviously a lot of you will have more than that in there, but this is just as as a guide. So, you go into ES File Explorer, first thing you're going to do is go down to the bottom and make sure the option that says show hidden files is toggled on, so make sure it looks like that excuse the pets in the background if you can hear them fighting so yeah you're gonna need to make sure that's on uh, what you're gonna do then is go to local internal storage then it will be Android data and then the org.xbmc.cody Go into the file section, Cody again. Now, if you if you don't see that Cody one there, that's because the hidden files has not been ticked properly. Um, so hopefully, it should take to this section. We should then see. Let's have a look. User data, and there's the favorites.xml that you need. Now, what you need to do on a Fire TV is. Just keep hold of your normal OK button, the big circle button in the middle. Keep hold of that. And it'll put a tick on it. What you're going to want to do then is go to the bottom row, click Copy. And on the left-hand side here, go to Downloads. Click Paste at the bottom of the screen. As you can see there, the favourites.xml file is now saved in your downloads. So what we're going to do now is go ahead and update Cody. Hopefully this shouldn't take too long. Uh, if it does, I'll just skip a bit of the, the video out but, or just fast forward a little bit. So 6.2.1, you can see 6.2.2. .2. Normally now this was where it would wipe all the favourites, nothing would be on it and we'll go in and check that in a minute. So once this is downloaded, uh, I'm also going to do a couple of other, other videos um, a couple of other IPTV ones, um, a few top tips for Cody, and also uh, for those of you who want to start maybe fiddling around with your own Cody but don't want to do it on that app, there is another app that you can put on called SPMC um, which will run alongside Cody. It's exactly the same, pretty much, just run by somebody else, but it works exactly the same. You can have both apps up together at the same time, so you could have my build or somebody else's build. Uh, as your main Cody, then if you want to play about with it and have a, uh, a faff and see if you can design your own maybe, or if there's another reason on why you want um, another Cody on there, then you can have both apps at the same time. So that should hopefully be a pretty handy little thing for you to 
to use for those of you who want to play about with it. So it's um, it's downloaded already. That's usually pretty quick. Um, it's just extracting now. Uh, it shouldn't take too long. I'm not going to make chitty chat for a minute. So if I just go quiet, just maybe fast forward it a little bit because I can't be asked editing the video. Just fast forward it until you see it go up to 100%. It'll only take a minute or two. If there's any other questions that you've got or queries or anything like that, for those of you who are on my group, just give us a shout. If I get time, I'll try and cut this bit out, but I probably won't. Alright, we're nearly done now. Here comes the dog if you can't hear my feet. Everybody want to say hello to Macy? Say hello, Mace. Hello everybody, my name Macy. You want to see a cat as well? Say hello Sky. No, she's not much of a fan. Oh, get out of the way. Right, now they're fighting. Right, we're at 97%, 98 uh, As you'll be aware when you do this, a lot of you say it's not worked, it's not worked. Read the message. You have been crystallised. You must now close Cody, unplug your device and restart. Force close Cody. Would you like to continue? Question mark. If there's an error, reboot the box. There will be an error. So, you see? So you don't technically need to reboot it. You can do if you want. You can normally just go into your apps section. So I think we're going to say, it's all changed on this new one. Um, Applications, manage applications, go down to Cody, force stop it, just launch the application again. And hopefully we should be on, there we go, we're on 6.2.2. We'll check the favourites and hopefully they've all disappeared for now, there you go, all gone. So now this is where the real test begins. Will it work? ES File Explorer. file you just copied copy it again you probably don't need to do this but just this is a problem you've got to navigate around so copy it do the opposite of what you did before internal storage android data org.xpmc cody try and get onto that the easiest way is go to the left hand side go next to it and then press across. Files, Cody, and then I can't remember what it was before. User data, then, and there you go, so the favourite. So all you're going to need to do on this is literally just paste over it. So already exists, overwrite it. I'm not sure if Cody needs to be force closed for this to work, but we'll just try it on here. It might force close it automatically for you and reopen it. No, I think you'll need to force close it because the setting's been changed. So what you do, rather than open it, again, you can restart your box or go to settings, applications, manage and install applications, Cody, force stop, then launch it and now will it have worked? This is the test, shall we see? Am I a genius or am I a dumbass? <laughs> you all know the answer to that. There you go. So that's how you save your favourites and update it without losing everything. Any other questions? Give us a shout.